Hi guys. Huh. Not quite a Friday waffle. Not quite a midweek waffle. Uh, it's a Sunday. I've put this up now. It's a Sunday waffle. If I put it up tomorrow, it's a Sunday waffle. <laughs> Sunday strike Monday. Whatever. Uh, yeah. Busy work. Busy work. But, yeah. Uh, just wanted to say one thing. Thank you all. I've now over 300 subscribers. Brilliant. Don't know why. <laughs> Don't know why you want to watch me mess about with uh, Oni and Arlo and do stupid skits and stuff, but thank you very much. Uh, hope you're all enjoying it. Uh, where was I last time? Oh yes, I'd went to a, I was going to go to a car show in Rill. Uh, unfortunately the weather was horrendous uh, and there was only a handful of cars turned up. I felt really sorry for the organisers, you know, which was just one of those British weather things. Um, like I said, I think there's about 10 of us turned up and I think there's supposed to be about 30 altogether, uh, the other 20. Obviously if you've got a nice car and you don't want it out in the rain, you're not going to bring it out, you know, you're just not. Um, I respect the guys that like their cars like that and they don't want to bring them out, that's fine, that's brilliant. It's the same with the bikers, we have the fair weather bikers. So yeah, not a problem with that at all. But as Oddie sits out all day on the drive, I took him down there and yeah, uh, still enjoyed it, even with the, the rain. Um, but on his oil, yes, um, I've driven him a couple of times actually since I changed that oil. There's been no loss of water and the oil is still as clean as it was fresh oil. So, I don't know, I don't know. I think it's just going to be a time thing with it to see, uh, see what happens with him. But long term, like I said anyway, the engine's coming out over the winter anyway, so... But he seems to be running, he seems to be running really well, actually. I actually enjoyed the run. I think sometimes letting them sit doesn't help them, uh, and I think that's that. Plus the mixture of the old, whatever oil was put in, and the mineral oil that I put in. Who knows? But yeah, um, so what else can I say that can be coming up for you guys? I mean, it's um, I'm in a bit of a, not in a lull, but in an area where I need to start jobs. Don't want to start them, if that makes sense. Uh, with Oddy, I just want to get him through this last classic car show um, the end of August. Well, settled in Bank Holiday August, which is not far away really. Then, I think it's time then I'm going to take him off the road and I'm going to strip him apart. And I am going to do a bit of a restoration on him. Um, that has been decided. Um, so there will be plenty of plenty of content there uh, from the initial strip down to rust repair, any rust repair, welding, right the way down to stripping down to bare metal, uh, stripping the whole car apart, blowing it apart to different parts. And I do want to get, I really do want to get is a rosset, I can never say, a rotisserie, that's the one, the rotisserie. Yes, I want a rotisserie because I want to strip him back to the bare shell, get him on the rotisserie so I can get him on his side and I can completely strip everything off the underside, everywhere, back to bare metal, zinc priming and start build, build you know what I mean, building on from there then. Uh, and then we will sort his bodywork out, I have decided I'm going to do the bodywork. I was going to leave the dent, but I thought the car deserves it, it deserves a second shot at life. So if I do a, it's not going to be a concourse restoration, but if I do a restoration to where he's going to last for another 10, 15 years, bearing in mind they're only designed to last for about four or five when they were built. So yeah. So yeah, so that's the plan with Oddie. The plan with Arlo is Still, yeah, I've still not got around to fixing this uh, miss. <laughs> um, I did mess about with the HT leads. I put a spare HT lead I got another car on 
on him and it didn't make one iota so I'm thinking it's not the HC leak so I'm thinking it's definitely a vacuum leak so with it being a vacuum leak I did think I did mention it on my last video I, I've got something coming it hasn't arrived yet actually uh, but when I can do a smoke test and um, we can have a look so that will be a video coming up um, it might sound like I'm repeating myself but it's just literally I've had I've had not I've had any time to do any any proper content for you um, I was hoping that car show content would have been a good one for you but unfortunately it wasn't uh, and the couple of cars that were there I've or, you'd have already seen uh, when I went to a car meet at Abacan um, there's a quite a couple of few of them from there so you've already seen the cars so, uh, you know there's no point in me re-putting them or re doing a video with the same cars in again you know I prefer, prefer to do ones I haven't seen myself uh, so yeah so anyway it's uh, it is Sunday they recording this I am on my way home it's uh, just after six o'clock in the evening shiny shining I'm now going to go home and watch the Formula One because I didn't get to watch Spa so I'm going to go home and watch that and then uh, back to work tomorrow uh, then I have got a few days off next week so I'll see if I can get something else for you see what I can do enjoy the rest of your weekend see you soon